I, I don't think uh, we in today's time anything black or white exists. It's all grey, and that's the beauty of life. Uh, there are certain things, you know, those nuances. Uh, it, it's 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 finer tunings, I would say, in life, which is so much there in karmiyud, which in, I I would say rarely you see, you know. so much of reality in in a in a family drama which is be- based in india i would say yeah acha theek hai so when do i give an audition so he looked up he looked at me and he's like what audition and i said no i mean i have to give an audition na to get this role so he said no you're doing it so then i was like oh, okay <laughs> i mean the uh, बिकॉज ये पहली बार हुआ है मेरे साथ यू नो बिकॉज अदरवाइज यू नो फॉर फैक्ट अच्छा ऑडिशन होंगे ये होगा वो होगा एक्सेट्रा एक्सेट्रा ओवर टू यू कॉल यू मैम मैम फिर से ओके वेलकम टू न्यूज एटीन शोशा माय नेम इज जीनिया एंड टुडे वी हैव विद अस the cast and the director of the upcoming series karm youth we have with us rabi adhikari we have who has directed the show we also have pauli dam we have satish kaushik and we have pranay pachauri hello and welcome to news edin shosha hello hi thank you thank you so much thank you so first things first ek to matlab when we saw this uh, trailer na itna zyada intriguing laga ki kya ho raha hai kahan se kya ja raha hai so how like How did you guys come on board? I'll go ahead with the cast first, and then come to you, Ravi sir. So uh, we'll start with Satish sir. First, first of all, my good luck. Second, <laughs> my talent. Third, <laughs> Ravi. Ravi is a very close uh, colleague, uh, son, friend, and he was he used to assist me in my feature film, you know. And when he came to narrate me and subject, you know, a story, a character. for a web mm-hmm. series i was very excited to work with him because i thought the person who has worked with me is going to direct me who uh, you know who took all my shoutings and you know <laughs> running around jobs and this thing he was he used to be very quiet on the set i remember you know but uh, he came with such a fantastic script and a, a role which um, that time nobody was thinking about me you know uh, to play a very uh, subdued role very uh you know uh, uh, it, uh, the the head of the family the head of a business family you know uh, uh, a, a bengali character and then it had great layers so i was very excited that here is this boy who worked with me who is kind of uh, 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 you know grown up so much that he is coming out with such a complex and very layered story you know and uh, and very intriguing very interesting with a lot of drama into it so that matlab uh, it was there, there was no choice for me first of all i knew him so well uh, second the script was fantastic and the role was fantastic so i had to be on the board that here is you know a person uh, you know who worked with me giving me something to perform you know and totally different what satish kaushik was being known for so that that was one of the best and good reasons to be on the board and i would add to this how proud were you as the person like as if i may say as his mentor how proud were you of course very proud because uh, when you see people growing uh, the younger people growing getting their mind set uh, to do something very different uh, to do very uh, something very very intriguingly complex structure stories you know and tell tell a story which uh, nobody has uh, you know uh, 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 narrated, and I thought that it was it was like a Mahabharat saga. You know, it was the the whole relationship structure, the business structure, the the people in the this thing. How how we you know for the for the power uh, uh, you know to get you to get your power. How you relate to your family and how you fight with your family. So I think it was I I felt very proud of him that uh, this boy has really come of his age and uh, get get got into this zone. which was very very uh, interesting very dramatic and very focused you know ravi is very focused quietly very focused you know that's the best thing you know so i of course i feel uh, very proud of my prodigy that you know he kind of uh, came and directed and built this up and today the trailer is being 
uh, lapped up by the audiences wow that's a, i also believe that's a very proud like very uh, nice good moment for ravi to be hearing this about himself i am i don't know where am i right now <laughs> mentally emotional <laughs> <laughs> okay tamik ka kitu pauli uh you know like like i said there must have been some like what was the most compelling reason because if we look at your career graph both in bengali cinema and in uh, you know hindi cinema or ott it's been very different very refreshing every role that you choose is very different from what you have done before so how do you always manage to you know find different roles and take things up <laughs> thank you so much i think it's karm and youth <laughs> <laughs> very nicely put karm karm karte jao youth to chalega hi <laughs> i would say yeah i would say uh, that's always a lookout for me i just uh, keep on you know like whatever falls on my lap mm-hmm. i just somehow uh, feel like doing uh, something which i have not attempted er- earlier so you know like new kind of characters new kind of approach new kind of human psyche you know something like that which i have not done before and thanks to ravi like uh, he thought of me in this in this uh, such an important character in the entire series and um, i i would like to add something to this like initially when i was approached for it first time when he uh, when i got a call from my writer and i got a narration and i found like uh, somehow i couldn't relate to indrani so <clears throat> i was not very confident of uh, like uh, taking it up yeah and i, I of course ravi had in- mentioned this in earlier interview that i said no it was not like that no no because <laughs> somehow i was trying to make myself uh, convinced about how to approach this because indrani uh, has qualities which you can relate to indrani has also has qualities which you can't relate to so the so that's a very I mean, that i couldn't relate to i wouldn't say uh, not everyone i think people will find her relatable some way or the other because she is mm-hmm. that she's a combination of that calmness and the the feisty woman that she is and uh, you know like uh, ladki lege hindustan kind of some, some kind of mindset that she has the fighting spirit that she has the spirit that i think every woman in bengal they carry forward from it's 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 a it's a genetic thing that we have like you, you know like looking after the family you're a big girl yeah <laughs> yeah <Yeah. laughs> so uh, so the you know like taking care of the family taking care of the business the work the balance between work and family so i think uh, uh, we who come from the eastern part of uh, the country we can uh, understand the journey so that uh, uh, interested me more that intrigued me also uh, first of all i wasn't sure but at the same time then slowly slowly when i uh, i kept on reading and had a discussion with ravi over and over mm-hmm. again and the, how the character fleshed out you know the layering of the things i fa- i felt like i haven't approached something like this so let me do this and it's also talking about my city of joy but i don't think calcutta has been uh, captivated you know like captured in a way which is so captivating i mean it's so so different you know like we have seen calcutta in a very sweet sweet format in a very romantic yeah. format ah but not that uh, the underbelly the brutality that also exists it can exist in anywhere in any so, job actually but what i felt was very different for this show is that you you, you uh, a place like bengal where you have certain you know certain visuals you already have you already hmm. know what you have seen in cinemas earlier but uh it's a very a family where all these you know this family feud this family revenge and all these complexities within the family which keeps on happening keeping the geography bengal so i think that's a very interesting combination uh i i think for for the audience to watch it true because generally when it's a busy family or something big going on we generally uh, see the location being shifted to delhi because delhi mumbai yes uh-huh. <laughs> but not cal right Cal is, yeah. you know, we always think very artistic, you know, very cultural, like maybe a poet or maybe a jhola wala from Bengal. But you know, corporate, you know, glamorous. Hmm. Uh, this woman who is uh, taking up everything, who is trying to strive and fight in a man's world, 
uh, in a in a in a world which is uh, a patriarchal space uh, i think that's a very very beautiful uh, thing that uh, ravi and rehan they have done it together in stitching the characters weaving the characters and also writing the script so in a layered way wow. and prane uh, coming to you what was the reason that made you take up the uh, series and i would also like to ask you about your character because we just saw some uh, scenes you know and it already looked so interesting kind of like who are you playing what are you doing there are very uh, many shades in the character that we saw in the trailer um i mean jaise uh, sateesh sir mm-hmm. and pauli have just mentioned that the world uh, rehan and uh, ravi sir have created Uh, it's a very interesting world you see kolkata in a different light uh, uh, you see the roy family uh, you know aur inka hi karm aur yuddh aur sab kuch chal raha hai sath mein but other than that uh, you know as an actor uh, you are so uh, in your head you're always like okay i have to give an audition for this role only then i'll get it or i have to give an audition for that role and then i'll get it uh, it's very funny how i even landed the role because i had just gone for a meeting Uh, uh to ravi sir and for a narration where he wanted to basically meet me and and tell me uh, the storyline and everything and he wanted to gauge from his perspective kitna close hai kya hai kya nahi hai and for me uh when i went there to his office met him and he narrated this entire world and and what is happening why it's happening and my first question to him was ki acha theek hai so when do i give an audition so he looked up he looked at me and he's like what audition And I said no. I mean, I have to give an audition, na, to get this role. So he said no. You're doing it. So then I was like, oh, okay. I mean, uh, f- the because ये पहली बार हुआ है मेरे साथ, you know, because otherwise you know for a fact कि अच्छा auditions होंगे, ये होगा, वो होगा, etc. etc. So uh, that quality of uh, Ravi Bhai uh, sort of transferred on to the set as well because uh, you know he trusts his actors. वो he will give you the freedom. He will give you the free will. एंड ही इज देयर टू मॉनिटर एंड चेक कि क्या हो रहा है क्या नहीं हो रहा है लेकिन वो अपने एक्टर्स को बहुत अच्छे से ट्रस्ट करते हैं एंड ही गिव्स देम द पावर टू क्रिएट वट एवर इज देन योर हेड आई एम हर्ट बट यू डू वॉट यू फील लाइक एंड दैट इन इट सेल्फ हैज बिन सच अ डिफरेंट एक्सपीरियंस टू वर्क ऑन अ सेट ऑब्वियसली विद सच टैलेंटेड एक्टर्स हु हैव सो मच ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस बिहाइंड देम दैट आपको मतलब इट्स यू नो एट द सेम टाइम यू आर एक्साइटेड बट एट द सेम टाइम यू आर वेरी इंटरमीडिएटेड एज वेल so uh, to stand amongst all of them and to work and perform and to have a supporting director uh, i think uh, ye he reason kafi hota hai because kahani pe to main already sold tha uh, uh, other than that my character is you know just uh, someone finding his space uh, jaise off screen maine bola it was uh, intimidating and exciting to work with such great actors uh, on on screen as well it is uh, intimidating for my character yet exciting for my character to find his ground his place his space amongst uh, these uh, big players so uh, that's why you see all the shades and grays and uh, uh, aage i think uh, as uh, you know whenever the 30th september when the series releases and when you'll get to see tab aapko samajh mein aayega why all of that is happening that is happening and uh, i wouldn't want to spoil it for the viewers or anyone who's listening in or you know of course of course and uh, ravi coming to you you know i had spoken to uh, rajesh ji also before this and uh, then anjana was there and ye yeah. all even pauli what pauli said pranay said and e, satish sir to khair he is a veteran to any role you approach him with he'll nail it so but everyone had this thing in common they said that you had given them offered them a role that they did not see themselves also in you know uh, we haven't seen rajesh uh, rajesh sir in a role like that we haven't seen anjana also playing a cop and uh, obviously pauli she has done so many films and there has been so many shades how did you manage to do it how did you manage to achieve this uh, there are few things that just happens but uh, there was one thing which was uh, very clear okay to give something which is unexpected to anyone to even for actors if you give something which is not them they hmm. will that anyone I, I, even me as a director if you give me something which is i'm not uh, i'll given put in more extra effort into it to make it that and it will be uh, by actors also doing something that they don't relate to or something it will uh, give out something new to the audience also which is not 
they also don't expect out of this out of the actors or whatever it is so yeah it's like to surprise the audience to surprise myself to surprise everyone who's involved in the project it's always a challenge to do something which you have not done earlier and you uh, lived up to this challenge looks like you did really well because that's ah. what i have been hearing okay. from all the stars who have been a part of karmyun let's so i'm keeping my fingers crossed <laughs> I'm honored okay. if we all feel that. <clears throat> And you know, uh, this is a very, uh, this looks like a very dark, not very dark. I shouldn't say that, but it looks uh, like it borders on dark. And there are very, uh, like it has a lot of politics. It has that space that when you get into that space, you might take time to go there and even come out from there. It's very heavy. it's it, it would uh, take a lot not just from the actors but also from the director because he's envisioning this entire world right so how easy or difficult was it to, for you ravi especially to get into the zone and to then create this world and then get out of it there's nothing i don't know it's not easy or difficult i'd say it's more about the mental zone that you are in Yeah, and uh, uh, if you're clear about your things, you about your script and about your your, your vision, then it's all much more easier, more smooth. I'll say other than easy. Okay, and uh, b- like I have to ask you this. I know it would be too early to ask, but is there a season two planned? Like anything close to like something on those lines planned already? Ravi. <laughs> Uh, that person is not here. <laughs> <laughs> See, everyone I, wants to. Master, uh, I would really go <laughs> for a season two. Not uh, season two, but many more to come <laughs> for the story. And because yeah, these characters don't have an end. They have so many layers that you can open up every layer every time, and there will be something which will surprise you. Okay, okay, and uh, coming back to uh, the actors, Satish sir, uh, was it also for you easy or difficult to get into the zone of your character? You know, nothing is easy uh, for actors. You know, and if it is easy, some actors make it a uh, little non-easy and tough. <laughs> that is, <laughs> and I am from that school. That if looks easy to you, make it a little tough for yourself. You know. yeah because then uh, then there is a uh, happiness to achieve something you know to achieve what your director wants writer wants or what you want you know so uh, it it was not easy but you know when as as ravi said that he was very clear when you are very clear mm-hmm. about 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 your script about your mm-hmm. act that uh, uh, the director wants some some kind of a different performance from uh from uh, your actors you know which they had they have done before and uh, shocking the audience you know surprising the audience with some performance so then the responsibility becomes much more because one has seen satish kaushik in uh, in very particular roles which hmm. made real which made them happy which you know the timing is perfect oh satish kaushik's timing is fantastic you know but you get to this kind of a role which is very real and and it it is great uh, power um, inside it so mm. then you know, the responsibility becomes much more big so it's a tough thing but yes when your director is with you and he's navigating you i know uh, slowly and slowly you you get the part you get the quietness you get the evil evilness you get the uh, you know a strong quality that power hungry this thing you uh, mm. you know about the meaning of the character the mind of the character so to to play all this director you need the director to uh, kind of guide you and uh, ravi being very focused about what he wanted uh, i think bisham roy's character uh, became uh, very very uh, you know strong and uh, this thing though though he's a head of the family and he doesn't appear too much in the this thing but his presence and his his whole uh, uh, you know uh, uh, confrontation with uh um, in the indrani indrani roy is very very interesting and to to see ke ghar ka hi koi ek aadmi jo hai na matlab bhai ki wife jo hai she is trying to uh, get over him and 
trying to square with him or some kind of thing which is happening between two of them so is is very very interesting and i kind kind of enjoyed it found it tough enjoyed it and got into it with the help of my director and yeah. and the writer rehan used to be there all the time and when you have a very young unit young actors you know you you get excited to uh, you know to show them something say buddy don't think that i am from some bygone era i am there bygone era to so nahi ho sakta ye to so it is your era wherever you are it's your era sunita ki jaisi apna great cinematographer ho you know ravi jaisa director ho rehan jaisa writer ho it 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 becomes your work becomes releasey you know definitely pauli and uh, pranay for you was there like difficulty getting into the characters getting out of it or what mm. was the most challenging part mai 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 bas ek baat bolna chahunga that uh, even though the nature of the series and uh, the entire story is very serious and and dark and uh, uh, you have no idea how dark it is so uh, <laughs> okay but, <laughs> बट हमने ऑफ स्क्रीन इतनी ज्यादा मस्ती करी है बिकॉज एंड दैट्स हाउ वी फाउंड द बैलेंसिंग एक्ट यू नो ऑफ ऑफ स्टेइंग डिटैच फ्रॉम इट ऑफ ऑफ नॉट लेटिंग दैट कैरेक्टर अफेक्ट यू व्हेन द जॉब इज डन यू नो सो ऑन ऑन स्क्रीन एंड जब हम ऑन सेट होते हैं वी आर ऑल वेरी डिफरेंट एनर्जीज और हम लोग बहुत ही अपने वी आर नॉट जोन एंड एंड रवि सर इज डूइंग हिज थिंग पॉली मैम इज डूइंग हर थिंग एंड हम सब लोग उसमें रहते हैं वी कम टुगेदर वी क्रिएट समथिंग द मोमेंट इज डन we go back we have a great party we laugh and we're all like kids again so i think uh, um, uh, in my opinion that's how uh, you know uh, it was over to you wow. pauli ma'am <laughs> ma'am please say okay <laughs> <laughs> okay so uh, genie the thing is that you know like uh, when you're working uh, in a show which uh, not just uh, I, i would add something like i think i missed out on it that uh, it just doesn't just it captures the uh, dynamics of uh, this uh, relationship in this family feud but it also somehow you know like uh, the social economic wo jo ripple ek hota hai because of you know in this particular family the three segments i would say the three important uh, segments in this particular family which is represented by three different individuals so the uh, the fight that they have against each other for this greed of uh, you know like uh, taking over roy group of industry so wo jo ek social economic uh, ripple that it sets off that is also i think was a very interesting uh, you know uh, thing in in the in the entire script and uh, uh, the space is yes it is dark uh it is uh, but i i would say it is real it's so human it makes it more human and uh, i i don't think uh, we in today's time anything black or white exists it's all gray and that's the beauty of life uh, there are certain things you know those nuances uh, it, it's 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 finer tunings i would say in life which is so much there in karm yudh which in i i would say rarely you see you know so much of reality in in a in a family drama which is ba- based in india i would say in a, 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 a in a national platform uh, a show like this you know i have hardly watched a show which is a family drama but yet so much of everything is going on so i i would say it was a very challenging space for me as an actor and uh, uh, also you know but what what you had asked the question to ravi like how comfortable or it wasn't that so mm-hmm. at times it is also important to push yourself in a uncomfortable zone from a comfortable zone so for an actor uh, myself like the ca- the characters we didn't explore earlier or something new which is coming up i know it's a ve- it will be very it's it, w- it won't be a very settling kind of a space it it will be a very uneasy kind of a space but even in that chaos you find some kind of calmness and i think it is also important for an actor to challenge yourself in a space like that that you are not stereotyping yourself you are not doing similar kind of roles over and over again so you are 
pushing yourself to a to a zone where you are not comfortable or where you may not know you cannot predict what is going to happen maybe you learn your lines maybe you know what's going to happen maybe maybe you know the composition but something changes last moment hmm. and it has happened in karmyud in so many sequences in one of the sequence uh, much later in the season it would come like towards the end you know it was supposed to be a montad scene we shot in one of uh, the studios in mumbai uh, which was created so that sequence was initially not there in the script which was later on written by ravi uh, ravi and uh, he wanted that uh, uh, like uh, some other side of indrani he wanted to uh, get it out you know like through the while while filming the series so uh, since it was montage it had to be a silent scene obviously <laughs> it was so beautifully lit up you know like a source light so dim and dark and yet it's so again in a very real space and uh, she was going through some kind of a down phase uh, that's only hint i'm going to give nothing else <laughs> so and somehow while while shooting it uh, ravi just came up and he said you know i, I just I, i somehow want to break the silence uh can you hum something in bengali or can you just uh, say something in bengali or maybe a poetry something which will break the silence so that's again a very poetic right it's uh, it's, it's it's very lyrical and beautiful and the way we are used to watching films uh, so uh, that i felt uh, really added to the sequence and the entire storytelling overall so these are the finer things which he kept on uh means uh, asking us to imbibe into the characters and also we also from our end whatever was possible we did uh, but uh, it was definitely a challenging thing uh, because the setup was very different from uh, what i think all of us what we have done before like satish kaushik a veteran actor like him but he a uh, playing an angry man playing uh, this arrogant greedy person it was so uh, so he had to channelize his uh in a self to it similarly for me it was channelizing so for everyone it is like we came to a zone which was so new uh not that comfortable but we made it comfortable for ourselves like a home matlab when we saw the trailer anyway we were intrigued and now having talked to all of you uh it feels like uh, i'm like i'm really really impatient for the show now so i Thank just you. want to see what magic all of you have created and i'm waiting for uh 30th September for Karmyo to release. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank, Thank, Thank you. Thank you, Zinia. Thank you. Thank you, Zinia. Thank you so much.